Hello uh, software testers. Um, in this particular video, I'm going to talk about a cloud-based uh, test automation tool called as a test project. Uh, it, it is um, a community driven and cloud-based automation tool, which is completely free to use. Okay, so this tool is widely used in automation for world globally. Um, this tool has a lot of um, good features compared to any other automation tool which is existing currently in the market. Okay, so this tool, the key benefits of test project is uh, it's a built on um, open source tool like Selenium and APM. Okay, so any any sort of applications on these two flavors, web-based applications and um, 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 mobile apps, uh, you can automate using a uh, test project because it is built on Selenium and APM open source platform. This tool is completely community driven because uh, um, the, the people who are using this test project, they, they can develop uh, add-ons uh, and uh, reusable actions you can share across each other and, and it's completely free. So it's com the, the platform is completely uh, powered by uh, community of the test project. And uh, test project is a Selenium APM ready platform. Uh, any tool if you take um, which are related to Selenium and APM configuration or installation, uh, setting up the tool is very, very complex. Uh, part of it, right? So whereas in test project, um, no complexities involved, any hurdles or any complexities involved in the installation and setup of the automation frameworks or tools, uh, it's not required. Uh, just sign up for this platform and you are ready to use, ready to automate uh, your applications. So that easy. And supercharged with add-ons, um, a lot of add-ons um, being shared on this platform developed by uh, community people, people using this project. So you can use them, uh, you can develop your own add-ons and you can share globally other to use it. Okay, so platform is, has got end-to-end -end test automation solution within it. It has powerful test framework within it. You can use for a web, Android and iOS application straight away without um, doing any modification it's very very a uh, simple package is enough to start with your automation and you can collaborate effectively with your team um, any artifacts or test you create within this project you can usually uh, share with your team people are sitting globally any any location and easy to deploy an execution so um to set up the test project as I already mentioned it's very easy and executing any test within test project it's super easy uh, you can you can locally you can execute and also you can execute remotely as well and test project works seamlessly with any sort of um, devops tool integration like you know jenkins team city pambos uh, anything you name it and also test project supports rest api um, of this platform, you can, using that, you can trigger automations uh, very, very easily. Okay, so this project also supports for a programming language like Java, C Sharp, JavaScript, and Python. Um, yes, we can talk about this in detail in future videos. Um, test project has a very uh, brilliant and smart test recorder, which can be used to record your web and mobile apps um, user journey and that generates a test very quickly um yeah so using this platform it's very easy as i already mentioned that just you sign up um yeah once you signed up uh, by giving your details um the full name and email id and password so then you're ready to log in so you can log in so in my case i have already registered so i'm just giving my details yeah so once you logged in um, you can see a test project um, dashboard where you can see uh, add-on section uh, mostly used uh, recommended add-ons are available here also a sample project is already available to go through that 
um, job monitors where you, you can monitor your test execution and anyway, we can talk about all these advanced features in future videos and also add-ons as I already mentioned that all the add-ons which have been developed on this platform has been shared um, um, you are ready to use it and you can just install it or you can uninstall it which is already installed um, you can do all those things here and all the test execution reports will be stored in the report section and um uh, yeah test project got uh, a very very lightweight uh, agent software um you should install these agents in your local machine and wherever you're going to execute your test so those agent information you can see here um and developer section so to talk about um java and different other programming languages can be used within this test project so that you can find it under developer section um yeah so mainly so once you log in the main thing is um you should create a project where you're going to create your tests within that project so to do that click on add new projects um give a project name let's say i'll just give demo one and description you can add and create Click on that. Um, let's say if I want to create a, a first test within this project, um, you can click on this. Uh, this project has um, a, the project components like where uh, all the objects or UI elements will be stored under elements and applications or application links which you're going to use across your automation that, that can be stored here. It's very handy. Uh, data source like test data you can store uh, different file systems you can store here like CSV or advanced level of files and parameters you can uh, all the parameters um, or the global values or maybe the values which you're going to use with your test all you can define here and all these values readily available within your project yeah so let's go back to project section where you can create test uh, create test and select we are for demo purpose i'm going to create web application test click on this and let's just log in test give a description click next so you can add your applications here if you have already added you can use it so in my case i'm going to add a sample project uh, website open source demo orange hrm live.com it's a it's a free to use you can use it for testing purpose um yeah maybe i can give you a, application name here enter your your finish so you can choose that application click next I'm going to use recording feature. So select recording feature and start testing. Since I have already installed agent in my machine, um, you can see sample application is coming up with the recorder UI. Yeah, so once it is started, I can see um, the first step is navigate to application URL been recorded here the from here anything you interact with the application all those steps will be recorded as steps here okay just click on this and enter admin and click on again here enter admin one two three as a password click login so you can see that as and when you're interacting with the application all those steps are automatically recording here so once application is logged in here so click on that menu item and click log out so application is logged out now okay so all those steps recorded here let me stop recording and close this web so your application is sorry your test is created here you can see all the steps recorded steps go to home um, go to project and your test is here 
and within the project you can see so um, all the elements you have interacted with the application has been stored here these are the informations here uh, if you go to test you can quickly you can play it back um, you have a play button click that and select which browser on desktop I'm going to choose Chrome click next run so you can see that execution is happening here entered um, logged out so the test is successful so if we go to report you can see one execution happened here um, this is the execution and you can see that all the steps details here yeah so this is very high level explanation about this pro um, this this project I mean this tool maybe in my further videos I'm going to talk about each and every features of this tool how to use in real-time projects so all those uh, we can see that thank you